Since taking power a year ago, the Taliban's defense ministry has put recently repaired equipment to the test, much of it left behind by Western militaries. According to Afghan Defense Ministry spokesman, Iniyatullah Kawarizmi, the Afghan Air Force has repaired 70 damaged military planes and helicopters given to the previous government of President Ashraf Ghani by the US and its allied forces. US troops destroyed more than 70 aircraft and dozens of armored vehicles and disabled air defenses before flying out of Kabul's airport following a chaotic evacuation operation. Around 600 pilots and technicians left the country during the Kabul power transition last year. However, 40 of them have since returned home, according to the Afghan Defense Ministry spokesman. The Defense Ministry also said in a statement that its engineering team had recently repaired 35 tanks, 15 Humvee armored vehicles, and 20 US produced Navistar 7000 military vehicles. Where did they cut it? Yeah, they cut it from here, like this. According to the Special Inspector General for Afghanistan Reconstruction, the U.S. transferred over $28 billion in defense articles and services to the Afghan government between 2002 and 2017, including weapons, ammunition, vehicles, night vision devices, aircraft, and surveillance systems. Some of the aircraft were flown into neighboring Central Asian countries by fleeing Afghan forces a year ago, but the Taliban inherited leftover aircraft. It remains unclear how many are operational. <laughs>